It's Sunday, April 6th, 2008, for those that don't speak that language, which includes myself. Um, yeah, I've, I've noticed that I, I often start out with these, uh, these random weird faces. And I've also been told by others that they enjoy the random faces. And then I think, hey, I enjoy the random expressions too. So I figured, why not start one? Start with one. Yeah. More or less, this week marks my three months here. Because uh, I guess three months is Tuesday or Wednesday that I've been here. But I will be, Lord willing, on a plane. And... If not on a plane, on the ground in Scotland or London, where they speak English all the time. Which I'm pretty much excited about because I don't have to think in another language. I don't have to do anything in another language. And the only thing I get to hear is some sweet, sweet Scottish, Irish, Englandish uh, accents. A recap for those that don't understand why I'm going to the UK or understand... Anything about that is every 90 days you have to, you can only stay 90 days with a visa, with your passport in the country. So mine is, I've been here now almost 90 days and so I have to leave legally or the U.S. government will come after me and make me leave. And so I'm just going to go ahead and go to England for a week. Uh, the reason I can't go somewhere close by like Austria or Germany or France or whatever countries that I border that I don't really know because I forget world geography but I can't go to those because they're in the European Union and the European Union only lets you get stamped in the first country so I got stamped when I came into France then when I landed in Italy they didn't really care and nor would they care if I landed in France again but they will when I go to the UK because then they give me a stamp on my passport and says hey you can stay another 90 days so that's wonderful um, so that's why that is that. Uh, while I'm in, Lo while I'm in the UK, I'm, I fly into London, and from London I'm going to fly straight into Glasgow, Scotland, where I will just spend a night, um, see some, some Scottish history, see, uh, Glasgow. Glasgow's the, I believe, the second largest or the largest city in Scotland, and, um, I'm pretty excited about it. Thanks to Ryanair, which I mentioned last time, it's super cheap. Um, I'm staying with an American dude uh, from Washington who's studying in Glasgow, and he's letting me stay with him for free, which is great. Um, after that, the next day, I go to Dublin. Yeah, I go to Dublin, and I'm really excited about that. Um, going to Ireland and Scotland, we're kind of like like some things that I've always wanted to do and hope to do and I really wish I could spend more time there and might even try to go again this summer or something I don't know if money and life and things and time permits but anyways I can at least say I will have been there assuming like you know the Lord doesn't come back or anything before then after one night in Ireland then I will come back to London and spend the weekend in London where I will do more couch surfing and I will be staying with some other uh, university students there in, uh, there's one I think that goes to Leeds, maybe? Maybe? I don't know for sure. But anyways, yeah, I'll be there in, in London all day, or all weekend. And then I'll fly back here on Tuesday. And then I'll have 90 days, which will be more than enough time to bring me on into summer. And... That's all I can tell you about that. Other random things. I got a haircut. Yeah. It didn't fall out evenly, turns out. Like, if you thought, hey, it looks like his hair is shorter. Maybe it all fell out at one night. But no. No, I had to pay for it. And, uh, I like it. If you don't, then it doesn't matter. I don't see you, probably. Um, 
Uh, thank you, new subscribers. Those of you that have just recently subscribed to my videos, maybe that was due to my mass imploring of you on Facebook. Maybe not. Maybe you just wanted to start to make sure you knew when I update these things. Because it's cool, because if people are watching, then I have more reasons to do them, and all that stuff. It makes me feel good. It makes me feel missed. Um, so thanks. Um, trying to think of any other real news that's going on here. Work at the radio is going well. Um, everything seems to be kind of just, you know, and I'm getting into a routine of, of what I'm doing. It's a lot easier. Um, I'm moving. That is something new. That is something um, worthy of mentioning. Um, I will no longer be staying in the house with the gentleman from the church in a few weeks. Just after I get back from London, I believe, I'll be moving into the church's house. Like, on the first floor here is, like, a pastoral house that's, uh, I guess, what we'd call a parsonage, I think. Yeah, parsonage. And they're not, they don't have a pastor right now. And um, the person who was living there when I first came here was no longer the pastor, but used to be a pastor and was the pastor for like 19 years or a really long time. So they gave her plenty of time to find her next place and stuff like that. So she moved out two weeks ago and they're going to do a little bit of remodeling between while there's no one in there. And then I will move in, and I will have my own place, which will be cool because I won't have to worry about coming home late. I don't have to worry about being super quiet. I can practice music uh, whenever I want. Um, I get to make my own lunch, which partially sucks because I have to spend money on groceries and stuff, but it also means I get to make tacos and hamburgers and hot dogs and peanut butter sandwiches, and ham sandwiches, and Easy Mac. I'm very much looking forward to all of those things. That wraps it up for me. I uh, hope everything is, is well at home, wherever you are. The next video I do will be after I get back from the UK, so hopefully it will be a lot more interesting. I will do my best to include pictures and possibly videos from there. Uh, this week I uh, will also be seeing Every Time I Die on Friday, which is awesome. And that's in London. Um, you can post your questions, comments, concerns um, below. And if you actually click the video, then on the sidebar there's like more. You click something like that, I think it says more. And then if you do that, it will show you the rest of the things that I type. And it'll have like links to pictures and to my other page, which is where my music's now posted, and all that stuff. So that's it. Grace and peace to you on the East Coast, because I doubt anybody watches on the West Coast. But if you do... Then grace be to you too. Ciao.